Hey there, everybody. Welcome uh, back to Pleasant View Farm. Today we're on uh, a new red farm. We kind of spent the day resetting and, uh, this farm back up. Uh, it was different. We changed it all about. I uh, even made a build barn set and everything for it. Uh, quick guess. Anybody guess where we're at here? By the front porch? Phelan or Levi? Shorewing Farms, I appreciate you seeing you here. Any ideas where we're at here? We'll just take a quick peek here. Down the road a little ways. Any ideas? Indiana. <laughs> Actually, I guess I don't know where this map is. How you doing, Scooter? This is, we're back on Back County Road. And uh, I reset everything back up. Got rid of the big farm down the road and everything and started with this farm so we'll get to the building over there that's a cow barn that I made for this uh, game map I should say so we got a few things I haven't got everything bought I think I'm gonna try to not borrow any money or cheat any money in. we're gonna just gonna try to make it so we got ourselves uh, a nice scooter special right here. Um, a cultivator, two silage wagons, but we still need a silage chopper, so we'll have to get to that. We got to we got this combined here. Uh, I know uh, it might be a little EU because how the grain hopper opens, but we're gonna go ahead and play with it. It's small, little international. We got EY modding, farmall. Uh, hint, hint, wink, wink, scooter, farmall. We have uh, a nice cedar, international cedar from Scooter's workbench. He sent over. We're going to test it out. Hope the block doesn't give away and we get our foot stepped on, but or uh, hitch on our foot there. But then this is the four row head for corn for the combine. A little sprayer. How are we doing? Hi, Sam. How are we? Uh, back here. So we got two Quonset huts, machine sheds. Back here we have the hog barn from Crooked Creek, which I don't have any hogs in yet. But we'll get to putting some hogs in here. The Gleaner S series be public. Much cleaner, Whalen. And then back here we have our big tractor and manure spreader. We're going to be running uh, the 1486. Uh, and then this is going to be our manure tanker for the hogs and the cows. So here's the cow pasture I made. This is actually one off Iowa County or Iowa Plains view. So I exported it, made it its own placeable uh, outside of Iowa. So we've got the milk cows out here. I've been thinking to myself, I'll probably end up putting up some type of little building for these are all milk cows but we're gonna need somewhere to store our younger cows but this is the old building here uh, we got the oh we'll head over there this is the uh, 986 our primary well mixing tractor uh, I want to say maybe more of the livestock tractor I did drop us a few bales in so we could mix some feed if we need to. And uh, these were some last minute purchases that I knew we were going to need. So got ourselves a nice hay bind and a hay rake there. And uh, last, well, is this our last tractor I think? This is the 1206. And then we obviously need a silage blower. I do know one thing I already forgot is skid loaders, a skid loader to mix feed with. So we'll be needing to get one of those. Yeah, Waylon, I'm not sure which gleaner combine you're talking about. Uh, thanks, Levi. Thanks, Sam. Yeah, I just kind of put it all together here. We got rooster modding. We got the Gale side throw and our my favorite J&M wagons. So I know it's August. But I did already set our fields up. Uh, I'm going to open these up so we can get those wagons out. But we're going to start here. Uh, 
the main farms here. So we've lost field 20 for the cows. So we will have field 19, field 27, field 4, and uh, field 13. So we're just going to start maybe a little bit scattered out here, but uh, we're just going to see how this goes. Uh, the wagons are just an edit of tired irons. If I ever get the chance, I'll fit them all upright. Uh, Rooster was, or tired iron was okay with maybe releasing something like this someday, but it needs cleaned up and worked on a little bit before it's private. And then this, I believe, is BSL's uh, manure spreader. But uh, so we've got, I guess I forgot to say, we got wheat down here. We need to get harvested and baled for the straw for the cows. Um, up here we have corn, small field of beans, and then right here, field 19, beside the cows is our gonna be our hay field. Uh, hopefully this field isn't gonna be too big, but. You have a red, <laughs> I need a red silage blower. I also need a red four row planter, otherwise we're gonna have to revert to the, uh, little four row planter here hoping not to use but we're not to spring yet so but yeah we have this hay field here I think we got another day yet here before we need to get too concerned I think I'm gonna bump I don't know what we're on right now uh, we're gonna bump her on up to two day season do you guys think Scooter, I tell you what else, well, I don't have an, I don't know, can you get the new Holland as a stack baler? Where's the new Holland? Let's say I need, uh, yeah, I guess he can. I need some red uh, bail wagons. For... Uh bailing for this. I also got to figure out what I want to do. I'm thinking about how to make the building so you can just unload the hay into it and because I want to use little bales is what I'd like to do but so we're gonna head on down to our field. We do have this little trailer with it. We'll see how I like it. It is a small enough header we can get around on this map and not need it but I thought it was kind of cool. So we'll leave it on there for now. Uh, Levi, I did, and I figured I'll just keep messing with it. Uh, I'll probably learn hip flex and go from that route. One of these days, I need to get to it, figure it out. I appreciate the help, though. I said I'm pretty new to this. One thing I do know I need to do is I need to upgrade mics. Um sometime soon if I'm going to keep doing this. Uh, I just hate for it to keep cracking on everybody like that. So I am pretty intrigued with this combine. If I could figure out how to get rid of the grain door on top and just have it open, maybe put some tops on it. This would be a pretty American combine. Maybe get rid of these pieces on the back and just put some side blinkers. I don't know, someday we'll probably end up trying to buy the... Well, that's a big field. We don't need that big of a field yet. Maybe. One of these days. So let's just take a peek here. Where's going to be the best spot? Probably to park and uh, get combine in here. I will just head right on. I think we'll just head up to this tree line. Uh, and then we'll get started and we'll dry it. We'll get back to the barnyard and pick up uh, one of the tractors on the wagons. Bring it down. Ah, that's one thing I don't have is a set of bins. <coughs> well, we'll have to figure out a set of bins. I think what we'll do here is we'll park our little trailer right over here. Let the traffic go by. We'll try to get hooked up to this head and not get hit out here on the road. 
Hopefully the cars are understanding. Traffic is pretty wild around here. Right, we got her planted right up against the tree line here. And we did get hit. Oh well, guy, we're, we're going to get out of your way. We're going to have to do a little uh do a little adjustment on this field. Bring it away from the tree line a little bit. We don't need to be that close. Uh, Levi, I have used manual attach. Usually I get forced to use manual attach when I uh, play with other people. I usually don't mess with it too much. I know some people really like it. Yeah, we're definitely going to have to move this out. I'm not a fan of being in the trees, but... I do have a little other, little other, another surprise here later on. Maybe wait till Scooter gets back. He'll definitely get a kick out of some big news I got sent today. Yeah, we're gonna have to come out away from these trees. I'd or cut the trees down. I don't know what would be the better answer: cut the trees down or move the field out a little bit. Yeah, once you get used to it, I think you're you're gonna be jumping in and out. Like I said I, I've just never, uh, never was one for wanting to use it. I'm still hitting attach when I gotta hit the button to attach it. That's how I've always felt. Try to stay away from the trees a little bit. I'm trying to get used to him. Yeah, uh, Waylon. We'll set this guy up here quick. I'm guessing you're probably seeing this. Uh, I didn't... I know somebody else is working on this. So I'm not actively working on it any... It was just sent to me. So, I mean, I did see some... Updates, whoever was working on it is working on it, so I would say sooner or later it will be coming out. I think we'll just make a couple passes all the way around here. But we're going to need a set of wagons down here before long. Now those old John Deere's are real nice tractors, yeah, if you get them all set up real nice. We had a 4020 growing up. Uh, it's in the pack. Scooter, it's in the, uh, let's see if I can find it. I always forget where the stupid thing is. See, it's already in here. I believe this was in game mod. Uh, no, I don't know where I got this combine. I went searching for it today, but I can't remember where I picked it up at. Probably some scummy website. But I just wanted the little combine. But the effects and everything on it are real nice. We'll get this guy. Let's see. I gotta show you something, Scooter. Maybe we'll just do it real quick like once. But somebody... Let's, uh... Let's turn him off real quick. Think. Let's just reset my. Maybe you've seen this. Maybe you didn't. Hopefully, I have the right version in here. Somebody did a serious upgrade to this thing. Put the different seed in it. Put more things up there. Uh, let's zoom out a little bit here. If you fire it up, 
put all the animations in it. I don't know if you guys all seen this today or not, but somebody spent the time. A guy named James Brandt, I think's his name. But the dash all works. If you see the lights in the middle of the dash clicking on and off. Everything vibrates and stuff. Yeah, so look for an update one of these days. This thing will probably be coming out. I don't know how to... Can you set your throttle a little bit less? Yeah, there. But, yeah. And I don't have IC, but... He said he's got it where the hood will come off and he's got it where this door will pop op or will open. So, yeah, like I said, look for that, uh, look for this update. It'll be coming out. But Levi, it's not, like I said, he's still working on it. He's not done with it yet. Uh, he put more customizations up there and all around, but it will be coming out, so. And I did fix the cab. I don't know if everybody noticed there was a black strip in between the lights. I fixed that. I didn't realize that was clipping through. <coughs> but hopefully you were watching Scooter. You seen the... <coughs> Sorry. That doesn't fit our farm, so we got to get rid of it. But yeah, so you guys, I know everybody here pretty much probably plays with it, so I released or uh, update for the Alice will be coming out soon. Like I said I know he added some things that will use simple IC. So if you were wanting to use open the door and stuff, uh, you'll need that. But otherwise, all the interior stuff will work just fine. And I hit hire a worker because. Uh, that was mine. He just basically kind of did what I started doing is just took JMFs and uh, added it all in. But yeah, he was, I don't know if you ever heard of James Brandt or not. He said he's released a lot of stuff, but, or in the past. He's been around since 09. But anyhow, he said he was just worked off mine for a bit and then uh, put all that stuff in it, so. Which I'm happy. I kind of wanted it to be that far. I mean, you know that scooter, but I just kind of lost. Well, I just got involved with too many other things. So, and he was more than happy to let me have it and release it. So, seems like a super nice guy. I think we can get up here. Trying to make enough room that he won't get hit on the road here if we hire a worker. I may have to show it off again like Magnum or... Because I know them guys really enjoy that tractor. Yeah, the effects on the head are really s nice scooter. We're going to need a tractor for the wagons here pretty quick. I thought somebody said that with this combine you can't turn the uh, uh, window off for straw, but I haven't really tried it. Yeah, it doesn't look like you can turn the window off. So we need to get ourselves a get some work. Focus one up on the old wagons. Uh Sam, if anybody was looking for it, I think it was Scooter, but I can always send it to him too. 
This thing has got a sweet turbo sound to it. Got a lot of JCL tractors in here. Oop, I wasn't paying attention. Got a 915 would work out good on this farm scooter. Is that from you? Something of yours? The turbo sound, is that something from yours? Yeah, the 915 would look better than this 1420 guy had one. I can't believe uh, a dealership close to me, they've got a, uh, it's a 1620 International. But uh, it only has like 200 hours on it or something, but they want $75,000 for it. I'm like, holy cow, that's more than what it was brand new. We'll park him right there. Should be fine. We'll hop up here in the combine. Oh, these wagons do look pretty good. I like the J&M sticker. I mean, I don't think they're a whole lot different. I'd like to make it a little bit more different, but they definitely look good. Yeah, this header would probably work good on your 915. It's already got the IH logos on it. Yeah, I would definitely, I'd put a 915 on this map. It does seem to have a little bit larger fields, but we'll just truck away at it. See, I need a different combine than this one, because this one's got that stupid EU lid on it. I said I even thought about taking it in the blender. The only problem of it is it's all one model. But I can probably, could figure it out, but get rid of it and put a American style top on it and get rid of these lights on the back. I don't think this combine would have those. Oh, did you add, Sam, that's pretty cool. Did you add them to the uh, in-game 4030 and 4430? Oh, there is American 1440 out? Huh. I thought I'd, I'd look for one. I thought this was the only one I could find. I thought I'd seen some people talking that there wasn't one yet, so I just assume this is the one everybody was using. You know where it's at, Levi? Or not really? Can't remember. So where did you did you just have that sound scooter for the Turbo 1206, or did you? I don't think you got one that big. Hi, Rank. How are you doing? Glad to see you. Hey, talk to you later, Sam. Uh, have a good one. Glad to see you. Stop by. Sounds good, Levi. Much appreciated. Might take this little combine a lot longer than I thought, but I think what we're going to do is get him started. Got to figure out what we're going to do with our grain. Probably just take it to the elevator. We don't really need the wheat for anything. I think the pigs just take corn. Oh, I don't have pigs in yet. You got it from the 560 turbo. I got gotcha. you. 
what I think we'll do is we'll get him lined up. Looks good. We'll head up. What tractor do we want to mow with this one? No, yes, it could probably run the mower, couldn't it? Seen all the levers and everything on this tractor work. I was thinking this mortar would be a raking tractor, but maybe it'll be a mowing tractor. Hey, that's not any good, uh, rank, uh, when the silage chop. We're usually an expensive piece of equipment. It would, yeah, 560 would be. Nice, get rid of this thing, get a 560. I don't know if it's gonna have enough power to run this thing. We'll see anyways. Not, uh, oh, I did not have enough, but I must have hit the, but I guess it's going to work out just fine. Always oh, makes me laugh that they make the, uh, how this always works, but it works pretty good. Need to slow her down just a little bit, though. Going a little fast. But I want to lay it right out, uh, because I want to, uh, probably bail it. Yeah, I'll probably bail it. Do you have this set up so I can hire an AI worker once I make a pass all the way around here, I guess? We also got to keep an eye on our guy combining. I should go check on him real quick. Kind of figured he was going to make a mess here in this corner. Too many trees. Let's go ahead and open this up a little bit more. Alright, I just was making sure. I figured you probably did it right. I don't think the hay rakes do, and it kind of bugs me. Yeah, 560 wide front, that'd be just perfect on that hay mower. So uh, when's the big, uh, uh, you said you got the week off, uh, when are you starting to work on things? Tomorrow? Are you still taking tomorrow off, Scooter? And uh, wait until Tuesday like everybody else to go back and get diving into work. I think three passes here on the end will be enough. Yeah, those are Juno's rakes. They aren't, I don't know if you released your rakes for 22, but yeah, those are the ones that have the uh, double rakes and everything like that to hook up together. So we'll swing around here. Get him uh, all empty again so he can get back and forth. That's a slick looking 1206 though. Ah. Yeah, I got you there, Scooter. They work good. I, d I just can't remember if they have AI or not. 
I know sometimes people don't add it when it's just pretty simple. I don't, it's pretty simple to add in, so. But this combine actually has like, you can do the same thing you did with your, uh, uh, haybine. You can get a restored or a old, old faded paint. So we'll clip another one on this corner and then we'll let this guy go. Continue on. And we'll get back to the farm all. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot you were working on that kind of stuff. I forgot I already started this pass. There we go. What do you think of all that stuff, the terraform stuff? I haven't really talked to you since you've been kind of working on that. I wanted to do some of the terra, or not like modding, but just play with the terraform stuff, but I couldn't figure out what I all needed to do it. Like I got a piece of equipment I was supposed to terraform, but it wouldn't wouldn't actually dig the dirt or do anything. This ain't a this isn't a bad little farm all. You're loving it like crazy. It's pretty easy to integrate it into buckets and stuff. Yeah, but don't you have to have like the terraforming base script or something? So that way you can like activate it or whatever else. I never noticed how much effect is in the... Uh, where the... Oh, uh, what do I want to call it? Like the reel pushes the hay into the binds how much it shows so we'll do one pass here then we'll go around backwards do the outside round and then probably hire a guy that way we can keep this job moving yeah I, I, like I said Levi I haven't really played with it yeah I don't even know where he I know that guy who's done it I forget what his name is uh, I went to his website. I thought I had it, but I could never get it to work. Hey, Derry dear, how are you? Yeah, I was playing, uh, which you probably see my screenshot. I was playing with your claws uh, chopper this morning. That thing is excellent. That John Deere that I have, I can't, uh, I can't figure it out. Can't figure out how to get that head to work. So I just switched and started using the claws chopper. Some nice sounds on the old hay mower too. I'm using the FS minor version, but I guess 5.0 oh, is coming soon. I'm guessing there's each version, maybe there's more stuff you can do with it. Like I said, I haven't really played with it at all. I, I, would, I wouldn't mind to, but I'm not really... I don't know, I guess I really haven't gotten into that aspect of farm sim. Logging or terraforming. Terraforming. Oh yeah, I got the big one though. I got the big Jaguar. Uh... I was kind of surprised there's really no goes from a baby head to a big head for the claws chopper needs something more in between I don't know what that little red head is like is that a four row head now oh, that might be a five or six row head I know the guys around here they run it with a I think they run it with an eight row 
chopper and head on it. An 870, I think. But what kind of... You guys run a lot newer, probably. Claws chopper, don't you, Dairy Deer? In real life? By something like... Actually, I don't even know the new numbers, so... I couldn't even guess. Like a 900 series, maybe? 970? Yeah. Wonder how well this thing will do on fuel. Seem to be pulling too hard on it though. Growing up, my grandfather had a Farm All H. Pretty sweet little tractor. And I don't know why, but it always seemed like in road gear that thing was quick. It was real quick going down the road. An old hat and field queen. I thought somebody said there was a field queen. Uh, maybe it was Sam. Sam Schultz. I was in here. I thought somebody had showed me there was one. Maybe in 19 or something, or maybe even 17. Uh, there was a field queen. Looks like our combine's getting pretty full over there. So get to the end and. I haven't decided. Does this field pretty square? Yeah. Trying to decide which way to mow this. Plano 6. Yeah, I don't know if he's really been working on that for 22 at all. It's seen there for a while. He was always working on something, but I don't know if he still is or not. Cut him loose. Take over combining. I don't think we're going to make it all the way to the other end, but we might. You weren't expecting it to be quick and <laughs> I, well, I think I told you that. I wanted to try to figure out how to get the swinging mowers to swing back and forth, but yeah, I know. He's just going to go back and forth. I don't know why. Yeah, without course play, which I haven't played with or downloaded or, well, I guess I have it downloaded because I use it on the multi-server player, but. It would be sweet somehow if they could figure out how to get them to go around in the circle. That's that. I mean, I guess there's no other way than course play, but it would be awesome to get the mowers to set up that way, forge choppers to set up that way. We might have to go dump our wagons. I will say one thing about this combine, it's very responsive. Fuel cream with a dump box on the back so you can fill the dump box and dump the silage into a trailer. Well, we already have that rank. Uh, Dairy Deer there in the chat, he has a uh, some type of dump box. I've never used it, but uh, where you can chop, fill it up, and then... That looked like we had a bird there on our wagon, but... Yeah, rank uh, Dairy Deer's got a dump box if you're looking for one. So what do I do here? Drive back down there and start over or start on this end? You might as well just go back to this side. Uh, what's crazy is, yeah, well, growing up, uh, my dad helped some guys farm and they had a one of the first field queens around here uh, self-propelled chopper or they had a field queen and they had something else maybe before then even 
But yeah, I've, so I've seen the field queens before in real life. I did spend some time in real life this morning working on my own real combine. Had to replace some cylinder belts on it. What do we got going on here? What in the heck? Maybe we're going to have to mow this field ourselves. Can we do this first person and keep it where we need to? Probably not. I don't know if he needs more of an end row to turn around on. Yeah, it would be, Dairy Deer. Uh, I've seen the stuff you've been doing with the new haul, and though. It looks really good. You got some killer work about to come out. I don't know how far along you are with it or how long till you release it, but... I kind of think that's the chopper I'm going to run on this series. It's probably... Uh, the new haul and I got it uh, installed so probably end up using it unless I go with the pool type new haul and haven't made up my mind yet the nice thing about a self-propelled chopper especially one like that littler one uh, you can I got it I, I, th I don't know if you did update it or not but I know I messed with the uh, our worker being able to turn with the headers better so they don't back up and jackknife and do all kinds of stuff but it is nice when you can just hire the worker you can run wagons in with silage or whatever you need to hi right, Jake how are you glad to see you you need a variety of the side pull hay binds. Yeah, this one's a really nice one. I do know probably it's, and Scooter's probably seen it. It's John Deere version. It's been out. Redone of this version. I think a lot of people stay away from them just because of the inability. You know, there, there are side pulls and the rear or the front ones with the winged ones they just you can hire a worker and they'll go back and forth with it but we're gonna try our worker again with this one yeah I don't know we'll try it one more time here we'll kinda watch this guy's all thinks he's done oh, he's up here though we might go up and this. we'll unload this scooter and we'll run over there and he wants what he's got going on. Yeah, I'm not sure what he's got going on here. I don't know if it's the tractor or the mower. Because obviously he did turn around once. Yeah, I don't know what he's got going on here or what she's got going on here.
May need a little looking into. I literally just downloaded this off your website or your Facebook go. We could try it with a different tractor. Maybe it's the tractor. Which usually it isn't, but get a little hay tether for it. Here, let me go inside. I forgot I have automatic or put the nine and eighty six on there. Yeah, I like I said, I think this is I got it off your Facebook. I think it's the latest updated one. Let's see what he does if we get him going here. Maybe it's because I'm using the old paint one. Maybe the old one's broken. I almost need like a 966 on here. At least the IH-1400 is better than the converted one that was released. They had so many issues. Uh... Are you talking about that combine? What do we got going on here? You need to put no backward. I think that would fix that. We might be mowing hay ourselves. Yeah, we might be mowing hay ourselves. I don't have course play set up. Uh, on this save. Might have to put it in though. Last, I tried to use it yesterday and I had no clue how to use it. Yeah, that's always something. Always something. Now the question is, do I keep mowing around in a circle? Or do I mow back and forth? This is kind of second priority. I want to keep that mower or er, come on going. Yeah, and I could probably I should probably watch that. Let's get over the combine. Oh, he's still going that way. Oh, I ain't got no wagons. Uh, we can dump a little bit on there. It looks like. Yeah, he's uh, FSG's got a lot of tutorials. Uh, very helpful. We'll top that wagon. All right, Scooter. Yeah, I just haven't messed. I just haven't tried to mess with it yet. I use course play a lot, 19, and auto drive. I just haven't gotten in that funk of using them yet. Hopefully, this tractor's got enough power to get us to the. Grain elevator. I actually think we're on the wrong side of the field for that. But we'll grab it. I think we gotta head back the other direction. Yeah, I've seen that coming.
Better turn our flashers on. So I think we have to go down and then back down this road. Yes, sir. So we'll go that way. I haven't decided for a truck for this playthrough. I think I'm going to play on this this save this one and maybe my Alice Chalmers farm but what's a, what's a good truck everybody's using what would be a good truck to have that you guys think would fit what I got going on here what would what would the AI extension mod do there rank I can't say I ever used it can't say I ever didn't or played with any mods in 17 She's, she's bucking. Got to park the wagon to the top of the hill. Are we spinning? International scout. <laughs> Is there a scout out, uh, Levi? Maybe JMF's pickup? Yeah, JMF's would be a good one. Yeah, that older Ford. Uh, I probably could alter JMF's just a little bit. I did like playing with that truck. I don't like how high it sits. I'd like to put some smaller tires on it. I'm not a big jacked up kind of truck kind of guy. Uh... I like, let's see if it's in here, that options, this is what I would probably put in this truck though, I like that, that uh, fuel tank right there, maybe a different toolbox, and I like that truck, I don't know, I also like this Ford, but it doesn't have to be a Ford, you know, we could play with something different, Dodge or a Chevy, There's one on King's Mod. There's an international scout, is there? I am not a Ford guy, but those aren't half bad trucks. Yeah. Surely by yeah, if it's if it's a good mod, we could give it a try. Is it? I don't think a scout's got a bed on it, though, does it? But do we really need a truck bed? I don't know. Not sure. We could have it. We could play with it, I guess. So I think we pull in right here. Yep. It's been a hot minute since I played on this map. But here we are. It has a convertible option, eh? Oh, that's nice. Can I put both wagons on here? Oh, yeah. I love when I can dump both wagons at the same time. Makes my day. Dumping twice the grain. So, yeah, it's like I said, I think I'm not going to cheat any money. We're going to try to see how far we can get. We're going to need a truck. We're going to need a livestock trailer yet. We're going to need planner. Need a good four-row planner for this. I thought about just doing dirty and painting the John Deere one red, but I don't know if I want to go that route yet. But I wanted a four-row so it matches our combine. I did see somebody was working on a cyclo planner, but don't know that there's any anticipation that would uh, release it. She needs a few more miles per hour. I'd like to bump her up to about 21.
She's a little squirrely too. We'll head this back down to the field. Hopefully the combine makes it till then. Looks like it's getting full already. Could use a little more smoke. Doesn't really smoke at all. But I can't complain. It's a nice tractor. I love the canopy look. Hey, no, no uh, rush, Levi. When when you get to it, that's fine. It's kind of neat that these fields are all stone. I mean, because it is back county road, you know, like back roads. But a few concrete or asphalt roads wouldn't have been bad. I've never heard of a GMC Astro cab over. When I think of a GMC Astro, if I think of an Astro, I think of an Astro van. I do believe for 22 there is an Astro van out there. We got a line of traffic behind us? Yes, we do. We're going to pull right in here. Get this combine unloaded so we can get back to work. We need to get a baler down here. I said my barn, I want to kind of maybe set up so it can do kind of like JMF did with the dairy barn where you could just unload into it. I always forget how to do things sometimes. Sure, grab a rake so you don't spend ages bailing. <laughs> yeah, maybe I could get the farm all over here. Maybe the uh, dairy deer. Do you know does uh, Juno's rakes? Do they have AI work uh, where you can just like one single rake? You, it'll go back and forth and rake. Otherwise, maybe have to grab like the Vermeer rakes. Which I like the Vermeer rake, but it leaves a big end, you know, a big space before it turns. Well, I need to get this job done. Maybe they're super cheap. More hard to buy. Want to check? Yeah, I've got one bought. Uh, could run it down there and see how it does. I should just put two of them. I should. I could run that while he's combining. But that's going to be a pain in the butt. Let's just see how this works. If we need another one, I guess we can somehow figure it out to get her down in the field there. I did see something cool I did the other day. I, I watched the D21 video, the Alice D21, and they had two uh, discs like what we have that are like scooters uh, discs. They were pulling behind a D21, and I could take the hitch for the double rakes and pull it the same way. It was pretty neat. And when I mean the hitch, I was talking about like the, where's the rakes? You take this hitch and hook two discs to it. Then you could pull them uh, together. It was pretty neat. I can't with the impact that's coming. Not sure what you're talking about there, Jake.
Yep, there's no AI. Should have just did that back here. Oh, maybe we'll hook another one to it. Oh, gotcha. There's the impact coming. I know somebody else has got a couple barmals. We're just doing all the old style farming today. What I need is like a three point rake like this with AI. Well, I knew somebody that was doing a three point rake. He wasn't here, Levi. I'm not sure if Scooter's still here. He kind of jumps in and out. He's a busy guy. And there's a tree. Cussed tree. Yeah, we're going to need more rakes to make this worthwhile. <laughs> yeah, I think he's working on farm walls. He works on pretty much anything red. Yep, I'm pretty sure it's just a work in progress right now. He's got a lot of nice older red tractors. I don't know what everybody likes to use, but obviously some people like to use the ACs. See how far along our combine is. One thing I am happy to see with this thing is it must have its own custom dirt because it's not, it's getting dirty nice. I don't like that the windows get dirty, but a little bit of dust doesn't hurt, but I don't like when they get all kinds of dirty that you can't see out of them. At least they're not green. <laughs> what about that other shade of green? You know, it's not John Deere, but a different shade of green. We might just nab the baler and just bail it. The other shade of green is fine. It's not sure what I want to do here yet. I want to just rake us all together or... No, I was kind of hoping I could just hire a worker. I was actually kind of looking at, or I can't say I'm not looking at, an 1850 Oliver with a loader in real life for sale kind of close to me. I think I talked about this yesterday, but yeah, I'd be definitely interested in buying a different shade of green tractor. What map are you guys all playing on, like Levi? Maybe I asked that yesterday, but certain map everybody's playing on right now that they're enjoying or looking forward to uh, a certain map coming out at all? I know a lot of people I think are waiting on for that Leon, Leonin, or however you say it, that RJH is working on. That looks like going to be a good map. Series four, that's and I did leave the D or D17 in on this 
quick save. I thought if I needed another little tractor, I could use it, but possibly getting scooters 560, that'd be a nice little tractor to try out. Griffin idiot, I I will play yeah, I did see Levi, I guess some of your screenshots. Uh but uh Griffin I did today, so I thought I looked at a bunch of maps, see which one I wanted to play on, and I did look at Griffin and thought about playing on it. Or I thought about playing on small farms, I think it's called. But I just come back to here. I just like this map. I got a full combine. Bring him over here and get him unloaded. And I might even try to do some video editing and try making some Uh, Levi, I mean, yeah, I don't know. A uh, map like this, this is, this is a pretty, you know, you can get into some bigger fields, but they're not overly huge. And this isn't a bad map. I don't know what you're all rocking, like probably what your big tractor is. If it's just uh, 8,000 or 7,000, or if you're running like the 8550s or something, the guy should, uh, yeah, I don't have him in here. Should work on something like the 4W305 or the 220. Uh, <laughs> Scooter actually sent me. Rank, are you in Discord at all? Uh, Scooter actually sent me a picture of some cab overs. I don't know if he was working on them or what he was doing with them, but. I'm not much into the semi game too much. So I just keep raking these while we're waiting on our combine or just grab the baler and start bailing. Nice. <laughs> oh, Scooter's, Scooter's the one working on the D17. If I were going to work on anything, D-series wise, it would be the D21. Trying to get the rear end fixed better on it. Fenders, the motor slapped in it. A side console with levers and stuff. That's what I would work on is the D21. Yeah, I think Jake, you're right. There is that, uh, I can never think what that guy's name is, but he's made a bunch of older truck mods and I think you're right he does have a cab over a little C series we might just go around here and get this all kicked together and what we'll end up doing is uh, get the baler out yeah, I think that's what I need to do. I need to start uh, maybe editing down a video. Videos. I know somebody was saying I should pick certain days to play on certain maps. That way people kind of know. This weekend was kind of just a uh, had time and thought I'd play. Just kind of play along. See once what people have. Like, are you in uh, rank? Are you in like... Uh, Tyson Deniz's Discord, FSG's Discord, um, Kedrick Farms Discord, any of those. I'm a part of all, are in each one of those.
Uh, this is a good job for this formal. You guys never know. Maybe, maybe I'm fiddle with the AI worker for this rake and get it working. It really doesn't take much. Just a little bit of time, a little adjustment, and you can get the AI it's all working. Have any of you guys tried this map? This is a pretty odd. I do like this map. It's a little rolling, but uh, seems to be a good map. One thing that does turn me off about this map, but I'm seeing it with a lot of maps, though, is the flickering trees. That kind of drives me nuts, but I don't know how to fix it or do away with it. I think someone told me it's a matter how the trees are placed, maybe, or there's too many trees. I'm not sure. That causes them to flicker like that. Alright, let's go nab up the baler. Or I guess we don't have a baler, so we could just have it delivered right down, down here. Uh... Can, yeah, that'd be fine. That's probably the one I'm in a lot. We do have a Discord. Oh, my settings are set super high. Uh, I've got everything turned up to like ultra high. I bought a new PC with about the biggest specs as I could buy for it. That or, uh, I could, uh, put the Discord that I'm in. Give me just one second. And there's a link to the Discord that I'm, uh, Fairview Farms is a Discord I'm in with somebody else. But I'm, uh, in it a lot, so if you want to join that one too, whichever one, no big deal. We'll try to catch this combine. These wagons do fit this farm pretty well, though. First thing about having that topper on there is I can't tell how full the combine is. I always hate catching them on the go with the wagons. It's not really. And you could, but you wouldn't probably be trying to do this in real life. There must be a little bit of space left in the wagons. Hear the cars beeping. Glad to see you both joined. Sorry, just looking at the Discord stuff. I don't have two computer screens, so... And I'm, I gotta look at something. I look at it through my phone, pretty much. Uh, let's see. We could... Get ourselves a baler down here, I guess. I guess we'll just go with the regular old kick baler. I wanted to use the wood wagons. Of course, I forgot to put them in here. We'll go with the old Nuhan. Go with the thrower. 
always like using that there. I don't know if you're still in here, Dairy Deer, but that would be a slick uh, hitch if you could put that on a chopper. We'll grab a notch wagon. Look up this baler. What does everybody like to do? They like to kick bale, or do they like? Do you guys like the big square bale, round bale? I've always been a little square bale kind of guy. I like a little square baling. You like to drop the little bales on the ground? Oh, it's like a perfect setup here. Oh, I think I totally missed. Well, I'm, yeah, I might have to figure out how to make that cattle barn pick or uh, take straw. Well, I guess it already takes straw. I might have to make it so it has an elevator for looks. Small bales. What we do in real life. Yeah, this is, this is what we do. Well, we stack them, yeah. That's how we do it. Your variety depends on what decade farming I like to do. What decade farming do you like to generally set up for, Jake? Do you like to do a little bit older? Or do you like to do uh, a little more modern? I don't know if I've played with anything newer than 7810 John Deere. I don't, or I guess there for a while I had the 30, like an 80-30 series, but. But really, ever since I started working on all the Alice stuff, I pretty much stayed a little older school, which is what I like. I kind of like playing with this older farm equipment. Eighties and nineties. Jay, I can't remember. Jake, do you uh, YouTube too, or almost seems like the old twelve oh six has got her hands full. Like is bailing seven miles an hour. That's that's cooking. There you are, Kyle, about time. Being a little stubborn there in the Discord. We're just doing a little uh, back county road farming. I need to go out. We're going to get hit by this combine. Stop here, guy. We're coming through. Oh, uh, traffic jam. See if we can get out around him. Hold still. Wait your turn. Yeah, my brother, he's kind of started making more round bales. I think we made about, oh, I forget now, we made probably 1,100 little square bales of straw this year. Use those for my calves. How are you, Kyle? If you're wa watching, say something or I'll show you our, the cow barn I added into this map. That's a placeable. A 
Wish I would have known you were streaming. I thought I told you I was streaming. Anyhow, uh, let me get to this end down here. Where I started and then we'll go over to the cow barn. Now we're picking up some speed. Probably not going to go for a few minutes here yet. I got to go get uh, some calf stuff taken care of. Then I'll probably be on later again, Kyle, if you're going to be on. I can't type. <laughs> yeah. All right, see like you're trucking right now. Uh, it's probably the closest tractor or yeah, vehicle. Well, this cow barn is the cow barn I added. This is its own placeable. Going to placeables. Animals, cows. Right here. So this is the big Levi, you probably know this uh cow barn. This is off Iowa County or Iowa Plains. But yeah, so I made it so now it's placeable anywhere. You put it on any map you want. I mean here are my open pans that are for uh, I don't know why that does that though. Did I change that? Any Uh, these are all for Midwest Horizon, but yeah, I made this one today. It's its own mod, so pretty neat. It should have a little brand sticker down there. I don't know why it's not showing up. Oh, you're trucking an ATS, oh, you big dummy. Yeah, do a rank. Yeah, give it a try. But so I got yeah these cows. I thought this looks good. This turned out good. I kind of made it so it leads out. I took Kyle's advice here and put some pathways where the cows go, and then I put this little dirt pad area where they would stand. But we got 60 cows right now. Uh, that's weird. I didn't ever seen that where you could see around it. That's neat. We got 60 cows. I need to get them some straw. And I got them a little bit of food already, but... Bessie looks happy. Sorry, what did I tell you to do? I don't know. But... Our combine full, yeah. But we're going to call it a day on streaming today because I said I got a few other things I want to get into. So I appreciate everybody for coming. Oh, your paths, yeah, your your dirt paths here, remember? You did your thing and you said you put these dirt paths in here where the cows would go. I took your advice. So, looks cool, don't it? But I uh, thank everybody for watching, and uh, not sure when I'll stream again, probably more towards the end of the week. And maybe I'll attempt to make some videos rather than streaming, so we'll see how things go. But thanks again for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.